Hi. How y'all doing? Sure it's dark in here, isn't it? <laughs> I turned up the light and everything. Oh well. We'll go with it. Today is Saturday the 21st. 2024. We're in the different moon phase. I told you that yesterday, right? The waning cr waxing crescent. Um, the weather today was hmm, cloudy, rain, some blue sky, cloudy, right? A bit different from what it has been the last couple of weeks. Temperature wasn't as high either. I think it was at 23, 20, yeah, 23. I didn't go out at all today at all. I had a shower, watched YouTube, my favorite YouTuber, Rod Hayes. He's not a YouTuber. He goes on other people's channels, right? Was on two vi two different videos, and so I watched them. I spent about four hours doing that, but I never got bored of listening to his wisdom, right? And yeah, I've just been sitting here, being me, talking to Source, the Universe. I haven't spoke to anybody all day. Just what I'm talking now. And well, talking to myself. I've done that ever since I was little, right? I'm my own best friend, don't you know? I am. So one of the things Rod said was in the upcoming months, guard your emotions. Watch your emotions. Don't get emotional, right? Because this is what they're going to be throwing at everybody to try to suck your loose, get your emotions, get you emotional, right? Trigger you, stuff like that, because that's what they like. So watch, uh, spend your emotions like you would your money, right? Or is that the right way to say it? I wrote it down. Hang on. Control your emotions like you would your money, right? Do you know what I mean? So don't just be throwing them away at anything. Don't be buying everything, right? You only got a little bit of money. So watch it, right? Control those emotions. Because they're going to try to trigger us any way they can. And the NPCs too, remember? They'll come in and try to trigger you as well, right? Because they win when they get you to be emotional. So don't do that. You might want to consider not doing that. How about we say it that way? Today the Shuma was at 29 and then to 10. I had a feeling that I wanted to go out and I was thinking about drinking. And I was thinking those are that stinking ancestors, drunk ancestors of mine again trying to intimidate or manipulate me into uh, uh, losing my power, right? So I just refused to do it, right? And it bugged me all day, I, you know, I could feel them pushing me, trying to get me to go buy a bottle, go visit this person, what I was like, nope, no, I don't want to be sick tomorrow, right? And so I was just like, yeah, I beat it. I beat them. And I asked my, aunt, my good ancestors to kick the other ones in the butt, right, to stop them from doing that. And it made it easier for me. It always works, right? So yeah, well, I don't know why, it was something in the energy. You know what's weird today too? I had it when I had my shower in the rise, right? About an hour after I woke up, two hours after I woke up, something like that. When I was in the shower and I had my eyes closed and I was running the water on my head, right? Washing my hair because I flipped my head upside down, put on the shampoo, rub it in and rinse it that way, right? And the water all runs down in front of me. Um, all of a sudden, it was like, I couldn't, it was like the bathroom had turned around on me. I couldn't think of which way was out, right? Was the opening that way or was it, because it's usually that way. But I was like, I'm backwards, right? It felt, it felt weird. Like the wall felt like where the opening was, vice versa. So I'm not sure what that was, a little something in the dimensions a time jump, a shift, right? But something happened. 
it disoriented me only for a couple uh, a minute or two and then I was gonna like feel the wall and find out where which way I really was right and then I, I just I wouldn't do that I was just like I know which way I am right I was trying to talk myself into it and then when I opened my eyes I realized yes I'm the right way around it was weird I'm not sure what that was about right but I did feel I felt the energy change today I'm not feeling like I did yesterday or the last couple of days right when I got up this part my my crown chakra was still it's still a little bit tender right but it was still icky sensations you know I slept a little bit better last night as well woke up one more time than I would like to have to go to the bathroom but I had a little bit better of a rest so that was nice I dreamt that only thing I could pull out of the dream was something about trees I was doing something with a tree what it was I have no idea right do you dream about animals in your dream they're your totem animals right your your spirit guides mine are dogs and monkeys right and I've been dreaming about birds lately but yeah when I was little I dreamt about bears so I got me a lot of totem animals. I do, right? I do. There are guides, right? But if you want to learn more, you look it up on the internet. You can find anything. I took a minute and I looked at Telegram today. I haven't been paying attention to it for a week or so, right? And uh, I was like, well, let's see what's going on in the realm. That's the truthers, right? That's all I got on there. And... Uh, and I was like, holy cow, look at this, right? Because of that P. Diddy. I knew, you know, the floodgates would open. And I, I, I said, you know, this is going to bring everything down, right? And it's just like, wow, you know? Camilla was a friend of his, you know? I posted a picture, you know, so it was Oprah Winfrey. And just so many, so many CEOs have stepped down. The same day that video came out, right? Or the news came out about him. So it's starting. How we'll know when it's ending. The banks will close. The government will fall. Will close, right? And then we'll get the EBS. It feels getting like it's getting close, doesn't it? it? Feels like it to me. When I was seeing everything, all those names on the list who were. Uh, at P. Diddy's parties, shall we say. Bunch of uh, petty pedophiles, right? Just crazy people. Deviant, you know? So, yeah, interesting. It's going to speed up. It's speeding up, right? It is. Um... I was looking at a YouTuber, too, that went to Haiti, right? And, uh, sure, part of, the, uh, part of the country is gang wars, but that's where the gangs are. The rest of the country is going about their business, trying to uh, work and look after their families and bring in money. Since they only make like 4 or $5 a, month, uh, a week or month. Can't remember which one it was, but still, it's not enough far from it right and uh, they've kicked their governments out right their whole sit capital center is vacant right because that's where the gangs are hanging out but yeah nothing's ne ever like it is on the news right this guy he was fine over there you know he went all by himself he's a Greek man what's his name Timothy Timmy can't think of his last name but yeah they're taking their country back is what's happening right that we're told gangs are the bad guys when actually they're the chiefs and the tribes what we were before the invaders came and stole everything and propped themselves up pretending that they were our governments you know so yeah don't believe shit and everything's infiltrated, right? 
So when there's violence, those are the infiltrators. You can tell who they are because they always cause trouble in your family, in your workplace, whatever it is. They're the ones that are always trying to egg people on to get into fights. You see that guy? You know what he said about you? He's an infiltrator, that person that says that to you. He wants you to get angry, right? Use your emotions. Start a fight. You know what I mean? Because that's what they do. And the original people were not like that, the organic people, right? We want everybody to have and to be happy, to have a good life and to be happy, right? And if we can help, we'll do it because you're like us too. You know what I mean? If you're not trying to get us to hate. And right now, I don't understand why Trump's doing that, trying to get people to hate Haitians, right? Because to me... They'd be the infiltrators. There's good people and there's bad people. Most of the bad people doing the shit on media are the crisis actors. Look it up. They've hired thousands upon thousands of them all around the world. Right? It's crazy. It is. I don't like that word, but sometimes you gotta use it. The felines here are doing fine. They're not acting up or acting strange. My neighborhood is quiet, right? I don't know what happened to the children. It was a nice day. You would have think, thought they were outside making some noise. But no, not at all, right? And our sleeping patterns and how we're feeling is normal for what we're going through right now, right? Especially the awakened ones. You know, the frustration and all this, right? Because we've had enough. Even my friend, when she came over there last week, she told me how she was feeling. I said, I know, I feel exactly the same way, you know? Fuck them all, right? I don't care. I'm not waking up any... I'm not trying to wake up people anymore. They're on their own, right? Call me crazy for all these years, right? You know what I mean? They just... Yeah, we're done with them, Right? sad to say we try we love them so much but i told her you got to remember tass three quarters of the people in the realm are fake they're npcs or clones okay you know so that's what it is right so and if you're feeling emotional during this time it's everything that's going on right it's the energy it's the planets or the, whatever they're putting out as the planetary energies, right? You know? The eclipse. All this stuff. So we're you're not alone. We are not alone. Right? We're not. The only people that aren't feeling this are the NPCs. And the clones. But the clones aren't going to make it. Neither are the NPCs, right? When the sun codes get stronger and stronger right and we move into the next dimension yeah they're gone they're out of here right and there's nothing they can do about it there's nothing we can do about it either it's just the way mother nature works and big mama the universe right or god as you would like to call it you know but yeah i don't use that word anymore it serves no sub has no substance to me Right? It doesn't. Because it's all a lie anyway. <laughs> it is. All right. I gotta f try to find something interesting to watch on YouTube here. And yeah, that'll be the end of my day. Uh, hopefully, we'll get good sleep tonight. Right? We'll have beautiful dreams. Let's shoot for that. Tomorrow, maybe I'll go shop. And I, if the money's still working, and the stores are still open, right? I gotta hit up the grocery store. But yeah, one of these days we're gonna wake up and the banks will be closed, right? And that's the beginning of everything being over and our new start, right? So just hold on to your horses, buckle up your boots, right? And we'll be fine. Everything works out. It always works out, 
and it does. Think about the worst times in your life when you thought that was the end, right? Well, it wasn't the end because you're still here, so everything always works out. It does. Did I write anything else down? Nope, that was it. I wasn't thinking about making a video today, so I didn't do too much research. I just tapped into Telegram the truthers for a little bit. And I was just like, wow, wow, wow. <laughs> when I see all the names, right? So, yeah. It's so messed up, isn't it? Oh, well. I had to get this way so we could change it for the better. We had to know what the worst was. So we'll know what the best is, right? So get prepared, because it's coming. All right, that's enough. I love y'all's consciousness. Enjoy this night or day, okay? Okay, bye.